In this tutorial you will learn, how to add watermark or placeholder in a text box in C Sharp. If you write anything in the text box the watermark will go and the font color will be changed to black. If you leave the text box without writing anything then the watermark will be added again. Keep watching the video. Take a text box. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Set the font size to 18. You can write any text instead of username. Set the text color to silver. Copy paste the first text box. You can write any text here. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. The button is not necessary. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Click at the first text box, click at the events. Follow the steps that I do. Double click the enter event. Write the following code. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Now double click at the leave event. Write the following code. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Select the second text box, go to events, follow the steps that I do. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Double click the enter event. Write the following code. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Now double click at the leave event. Write the code shown in the video. Keep watching the video, so you don't get confused. Pause the video, write the code. If you have any confusion regarding how to add a watermark or placeholder in a text box, watch the video fully if you skipped some part of the video, or if you still have any confusion write it in the comment box below. Now our project is ready, hit the start. This is our form. It has watermark or placeholder in both text boxes. If we put our cursor in the text box, the text will be cleared. If you write something in the text box, the text color silver will automatically change to black. 